balloon mission number two. These balloons are really far away. Wish me luck. Hey everybody, welcome to another installment of Donnie's Balloon Missions. As uh, you can see, it's a gorgeous morning and there's lots of uh, balloons up in the air. So I was hoping to get a little closer to them this time than I did last time. Uh, this time I had my 3000 milliamp hour battery, albeit not fully charged. It was about 95% charged. I should have left it on the charger overnight. Uh, I left it in the hot car and I think it uh, discharged a little bit. But anyways, so as you can see, we're taking off. Uh, this time I decided to fly in attitude mode uh, because uh, I thought maybe I'd use less battery that way. But as it turns out, it looks like I uh, travel a little faster in attitude mode, which uh, was an unexpected surprise. The quadcopter leans down a little more forward. You can see the props are leaning down pretty good. Uh, so I think I'm going a little faster. I, I can't see any cars. It's a Sunday morning. There's no cars on the road, so uh, I really have no way to gauge, but it looks like I'm moving pretty good. So at this point, I started thinking to myself, well, maybe there's some closer balloons. So I, uh, I did kind of a uh, pan to the left to kind of look for balloons to the east, and I didn't see any. You can see there, so I said, darn it, so I guess I'll just go after these balloons. So I pushed forward, bolt stick. I didn't seem to be gaining any altitude, I have to say. And I'm thinking maybe that's because I'm pushing so far forward that uh, I'm unable to gain altitude while moving forward. So anyways, I uh, made a couple stops and, and uh, raised my altitude. This mission was about uh, 0.923 miles, as you can see there on the map. So we're moving forward and you can see we got a little shake in the uh, gimbal, uh, but we're at full throttle. Uh, I still haven't balanced my propellers. I was going to do that yesterday, but I didn't get around to it. So I'm going to try balancing my propellers. The gimbal is new or at least the uh, mechanical part of the gimbal. I'm using the old controller. You can see I'm getting a little uh, altitude here because I was feeling like I was losing altitude. I don't know if I actually was, but it felt like it. So we're chugging along. So again, I started feeling like I wasn't high enough in the air. So I, I gained a little more altitude. I tried to gain altitude while moving forward, but I didn't seem to be gaining any, so I thought I'd stop and that way I could see if I was actually gaining altitude. And at that point I decided to head back. So this is my uh, 0.923 miles away from my original homing position. I decided to tilt down so I could see I got some crosshairs there. I know exactly which streets I'm over, so I was able to accurately plot on a map how far I had traveled. Now we're heading home. I decided a, about three and a half minutes into the mission to, to turn around. Um, I made it home okay, and I think my battery was good. I, I keep a battery monitor in my pocket that's supposed to uh, buzz at 3.7 volts, but it got knocked down to 3.6 volts. It's kind of a, the switch is easy to grab by accident, and I think I grabbed the switch by accident to change the voltage down to 3.6 volts. Um, that said, the buzzer never went off, so had it gone off, I probably would have been in a little trouble, but I always err to the side of caution. This is my longest FPV flight to date, like I said, 9.123 miles or something like that. You can see we got a little wind, that's why the quad's kind of blowing around a little bit. Not too much wind. Decided to pause and slow down and lose a little altitude here. Coming in for a landing, 
So far, so good. Everything's smooth. No issues. My FPV was working pretty good. I used my three wind helical antenna and right towards the end of the trip I started losing signal. So next time I'm going to use my five wind. I figure on one mile worth of range is about what I get out of the three wind. Looks like nine tenths of a mile. Again, uh, trying to land using FPV, trying to get better at that. So instead of taking the goggles off like I usually do, I decided I would land FPV. This landing wasn't as smooth as last mission, last balloon mission. This one kind of, I, I kept, kept felt like I was going down and I wasn't. So I said, all right, I'm just going to plop this baby down. All right, so there you go. I hope you enjoyed this video, and uh, we'll see you soon. Have a good one.